Right. The information department will assist the Malaysian Institute of Microelectronic Systems in providing explanations and clarifications regarding the use of the national digital identity. Communications and Digital Minister Fami Fadzil said this, among others, was to answer any questions that arose, especially those involving the security of personal data and how to register the IDN. Fahmi said efforts have been made by MIMOS to explain and provide information on the matter to the public and the ministry had been tasked to help. Kita tidak ada rakam cap jari, iris dan sebagainya. Tidak perlu kalau pergi ke LHDN, password lain. Pergi ke MyJPJ, password lain. Pergi ke MyJalan, password lain. Jadi semua menggunakan satu password. Ya, dan ini akan mengesahkan identiti digital kita uh, di mana saja kita ataupun dengan siapa juga kita berinteraksi. He said this when met by reporters at the Run Hack Scam Alert 2023 program at the Bukit Jalil National Stadium on Sunday. The program had not been widely carried out yet, with the IDN registration process to only start full swing in March next year. Fami said he had also requested that Cybersecurity Malaysia and the Department of Personal Data Protection Department to work closely so that any issues related to data and cybersecurity could be constantly monitored and addressed. IDN or Digital ID is a form of digital identification and self-verification for individuals which will be used by the public and private sectors to verify the user's identity when making transactions online. Without replacing the MyCard system, Digital ID is a trusted and secure platform that helps facilitate online identity verification to avoid identity fraud in online transactions.